Okay, so now this is another presentation video. I'm kind of getting in the habit of doing these because these are kind of fun. Okay, so this is a Sam Harris hating guy. Uh, runs a YouTube channel, GodTVRadio.com. Anyways, he posted this, and Sam Harris, I love debating and destroying atheists. Come get it, some. Ha 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 ha. I said, okay, <laughs> I'm in. Hey, I'm not a Sam Harris, but I understand his arguments intimately. Now, I do disagree with Sam Harris on specific points, but if you want someone that can tow the line that Sam Harris would tow, I can do that. A point to be considered is Sam Harris does not like debate. He prefers dialogue and discussion, as do I. For specifics in terms of how I disagree, I have a link to my VFE YouTube video, and I do recommend you check it out if you have any questions about the ethics that I'm applying here today. Okay. So, he acknowledges me. Hey, Mark, I've made a video for you. Oh, cool. So I go to the link. Cool. All's good, right? Okay. I watch the video. I respond, put a comment in his video, and he deletes the video. So I'm sort of regurgitating what's said here. His basic argument is that Sam Harris is is saying science is a value and is being treated as a value, a.k.a. guns kill people. I wrote, no, science isn't amoral. It is like a hammer. You can use it for hitting people in the head or a nail. It's how you use it that matters, which is exactly how Harris was attempting to use science in the moral landscape, a.k.a. people kill people. Now, this is the, the front cover of his book, Determines, which means to how you create or how you find, can human values. He doesn't say science is human value. He says it can determine value. So I'm completely consistent with my argument. And then he responds, I'm afraid that's not how it goes. Science exists because of the people who make it so. Uh, yeah. I am okay. I'm okay with that. Morality doesn't stop just because you deem it. Even Sam Harris isn't that stupid. You fail. Well, Let's start there. Morality doesn't stop just because you deem it. Did I say that? False narrative. Never said or implied that. He just wasn't paying attention. Stupid? What is stupid about? Why do you need to call people... What is this obsession with people and stupid? They need to call people stupid because apparently... This is an emotional reaction. When someone ever uses stupid, it's a good thing to remember. They're being emotional and, and they're not actually capable of being rational at this point okay they're just do saying stuff because they're emotionally reacting total emotion there you fail he realizes he's in trouble because i'm not following the narrative he wants me to follow he wants me to pigeonhole me in terms of how he thinks sam harris is arguing the point not an argument you lose i mean he's he lost no question about it you know, just to say I got it in context, deleted video. Okay, this is how this guy rock and rolls, right? Yeah, there it is. There's the deleted video. I just wanted to show you. Look at the top there. It's a user. It wasn't a strike. It was nothing like that. And there's a YouTube. You can verify that's the original whatever. So what does we mean by this? What does this mean? What does this mean? What, what are you telling me by doing this? You're telling me your regression of Radfem that's willing to go to Radfem tactics, right? That's that's what he's dem demonstrating. Right? So that's so why did you remove the video? Why? I haven't heard back. So what do we say to a guy like this? We say you can identify them by their fruits. That is by the way they act. Can you pick grapes? from a thorn bush or figs from a thistles? I think that's right. Matthew 7.16. Ooh, maybe I'm using his values against him. I think I am. If you act like a low life, you're suggesting to me that you want to be treated as a low life. As a matter of reciprocity, I want to treat you in the way that you want to be treated. Mark Hidden. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he is sows. So I'm working for the agent of God, I suppose. Galatians 6, 7. 
my actions are consistent with my stated VFE. We negotiate our values. Now, he has stated values as being a Christian, so I'm merely stating, I'm saying, look, these are your standards that you live by. How are you demonstrating those standards with what you just did to me? You're not actually arguing the point. Why do atheists want to talk to you? Because you are an angry, vindictive, vindictive person that has no values. My God, take pity on your soul. Well, that's what we should say because he believes in God and God should take pity on him. Because he's acting like a Satan, Satan worshiper, isn't he? Because he's not demonstrating the values of a Christian. He's demonstrating the values of a Satan worshiper. As far as I know, he's lying, cheating, and stealing, and doing all the things he says he's not supposed to do. Because he's acting like one, right? Something to keep in mind. Pity the atheists, for they will pay the highest price for what they believe. They will go to hell. What price are you willing to pay for what you believe? Think about it.